and White's death. A young mother is killed in Milwaukee over the weekend, and police say it appears to be domestic violence. The victim was well known in Milwaukee in the poetry circles in this city, and tonight those people are using the spoken word to raise money for her family. Our Jenna Sachs is live at 43rd and Good Hope with more on this story. Tuesday is always poetry night here at Nostalgia Hall, and this is a place where Anita Brooks would perform a lot of her own poetry on a regular basis, although to friends here, she was known as Anita B. And obviously for friends and fans alike here, her death is being felt very deeply, so they've decided all the money raised here tonight will go to the family she leaves behind. This is a video of Anita B. performing her poetry here at Nostalgia one year ago. The 27-year-old was killed in a fatal shooting over the the weekend at her apartment near 35th and Highland. Police say it appears the homicide was related to domestic violence. A 28-year-old Milwaukee man has been arrested and his case is being referred to the district attorney's office for possible charges. Her fellow poets say tonight is about honoring her work and celebrating her life. She wasn't just a, a, a good poet. She was a great mother, a great woman, um, very humble, uh, very soft-spoken, but she meant what she said when she meant it, and she meant something in this world. And spoken poetry will begin here in about an hour. I'm told the event itself will go until midnight. It's ten dollars at the door, at the door, and I'm told every dime will go toward her family for funeral costs. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Jenna Sachs, Fox 6 News. You know, it seems like a very loud um, background noise and all that stuff for poetry, but maybe that's that's kind of cool though at the same time too. Absolutely. They're starting with music, and in about an hour, they'll move into the spoken Got word it. part of the night. Okay. So uh, they'll turn the music down. Well, hopefully they'll get a good turnout. Thank you, Jenna. One person killed by a train in Waukesha. This